Hi everyone, I'm Ryan Alice, and I'm doing a video project entitled All I've Learned by 28. Here is part of part one about what I've learned so far about life. I'm going to be talking about values. My core value, the one I hold above all others, is one that goes back through many spiritual and religious traditions. And that is, of course, the golden value to do unto others as you'd have done unto yourself, to treat other people as you would want to be treated. And as you mature as an individual, often you're able to better put yourself mentally in the shoes of other people. And if you can walk in the shoes of a brother and understand what they are experiencing, you can find ways to be seen as a person that authentically cares about what they are going through because in fact you do authentically care about the experiences of the other people in your life. This is something that often from a neurological standpoint that true empathy doesn't develop until early to mid-twenties in some people and in some people never develops. But empathy, understanding from another person's perspective and to treat others as you want to be treated is I think the most important value. Anything can be accomplished all else is hackable if you follow that value. And so in this section, I'm going to share 50 other values in addition to that core golden value that I find to be really important, ones that I do my best to follow. Now, I'm not perfect. Everyone is fallible. I'm human just like everyone else. But I try to follow these values as often as possible. And going back and looking at the meditations of Marcus Aurelius or some Greek philosophers or perhaps even um, some of Benjamin Franklin's 13 values, I've been able to put together for myself over the last decade this list of values that I do my best to live by. Acceptance. I shall recognize the uniqueness and humanity of those who differ from myself. Action. Though deliberate and careful, I shall have a bias toward action. Adaptation. I shall maintain in a state able to flow, learn, and modify myself to fit new surroundings or occurrences. Analysis. I shall analyze what I do and do not do and attempt to define and derive inherent laws, axioms, tenets, and guideposts based on the effects of these actions and inactions. Best effort. I shall put forth my full and best effort within the boundaries of proper physical and mental health. Challenge. I shall often challenge and step outside my comfort zone so as to reach worthy goals. Commitment. I shall uphold my commitments and always under promise and over deliver. Communication. I shall make it a priority to learn and communicate extremely well with others. Confidence. I shall always be confident and optimistic and set my goals high. Contentment. I shall only be where I am and savor everything about that moment. Detail. I shall not dally needlessly in detail, but examine to the full extent needed. Environmentally conscious. Though I shall promote the mastery of nature for the betterment of living conditions of humans, I shall never forget that the earth should be treated as precious and that sustainability must be required if we are to survive as a species. I shall always keep externalities in mind in my business dealings. Focus. I shall recognize that while I can do anything, I can't do everything. Forgiveness. I shall forgive those who have mended ways, including myself. Generosity. I shall give to others however I am best and most able. 
health. I shall maintain my health and eat, sleep, and exercise in such a manner as to maintain a high level of energy. I shall eliminate negative energy, as my body is a temple of God that houses my spirit. Honesty. I shall be honest and forthright in all representations and deliberations, with myself and with others. Humility. I shall not be afraid to ask for help and not assume myself above another. Industry. I shall lose no time and always be employed in something useful. Reflection and relaxation shall be included in the definition of useful. Integrity. I shall act with integrity and in alignment with what I say I will do. Justice. I shall wrong none. Kindness. I shall live a life of kindness and compassion. There's no reason not to. Learning. I shall be continuously learning and I shall continuously read. Listening. I shall strive to listen and understand before I speak. Mentorship. I shall give the knowledge I have and will gain to others. Mistakes. I shall strive to learn from the mistakes I make and not to make the same mistake twice. Nature. I shall conserve and protect nature and ensure it remains for my grandchildren. Optimism. I shall always see the glass as half full. Organization. I shall keep my life and belongings in order while keeping space for exuberance and creativity. Passion. I shall always fight and strive for that which I believe. Perseverance. I shall not give up nor give in too soon as long as I feel a goal is worthy of the effort. Planning. I shall plan for my life and upcoming events. Positivity. I shall be positive during all times and believe in the power of a positive mental attitude. Preparation. I shall attempt to enter each situation with an intellectual framework primed and ready. Presence. I shall focus my complete attention on the single individual I am speaking with. Punctuality. I shall be on time. Reflection. I shall take moments to review what has been done and examine society and my being, my goals, and my habit. Respect. I shall respect all others. Sacrifice. I shall save and invest for today so as to gain for tomorrow. Sincerity. I shall be sincere and use no hurtful deceit. Spirituality. I shall realize I am a very small part of this universe and give thanks to God. Solitude. I shall have a period of peace and solitude at the beginning of every day. Spontaneity. I shall perform weekly either an act of kindness or an activity which I have never done before. Superficiality. I shall not focus on the outer but on the inner. Teaching. I shall transfer both knowledge and energy in teaching. Tranquility. I shall not be disturbed by trifles or that which is truly not important. Transparency. I shall live a public life and share the contents of my dreams and plans. Travel. I shall make a priority to see and explore the world. Work ethic. I shall work both hard and intelligently and not leave for tomorrow that which can be done today. So those are the 50 values I try to strive to live each day. Not always perfect. Now I'd like to move to Ben Franklin and his 13 values. Ben Franklin was an autodidact. He taught himself through many, many ways. And he was someone who recorded a journal from a very young age. And by his early 20s, had developed a list of 13 values, which he actually graded himself against every day in a notebook. 
And so his 13 values were temperance, order, resolution, frugality, moderation, industry, cleanliness, tranquility, silence, sincerity, justice, chastity. And he added later, humility. And he found that these values were very helpful to him living his life as he began uh, through his career to become a statesman, a diplomat, and an inventor. So in summary on values, your life will be massively enriched and you'll be able to sleep better at night knowing you're living with a clear conscience by following a set of values and by following the golden rule. I'll end this section by sharing our house rules here at Seward Street in San Francisco. Our house rules go by an acronym A, B, C, D, E, F, and they are to always treat others well, to believe in your magic, to create a beautiful world, to dance like nobody's watching, to enthrall the end user, and to fuse work and passion. Thanks for watching this section on values.